sure all of us dads would love it if fatherhood was like that. Receiving the cheers, the applause, the thank yous. But you know what? It's not always like that. That's why we need to find our fulfillment in spending time with our kids, making them feel like they're the ones that should receive the applause. And in the end, hey, that's how we receive our reward. Hey, fathers, dads, buds, and lads, welcome back to another episode of FC. This is Trent. Let's get started. Today's episode is a little bit of a, um, a recreational one. These next few video clips you're going to see are basically me recreating with my daughter. So we'll call this one three things I like to do with my daughter. Here we go. Okay, so we're going to play a game. Uh, and before we start, I'm Trent. Hi, this is Nasea. Hello. Wave. Hi. There you go. Okay, so we're doing one of Nasea's favorite activities, and that is sketching. So we're going to turn it into a game. And we decided to call this game what, Nasea? Sketch Wars. Sketch Wars. So here's how it's going to go down. We have <clears throat> we have one category of things that we're going to draw, and that category is what, Nasea? Animals. Animals. So we've okay. got how many animals in this hat? Ten animals. We've got a list uh, of ten animals on individual pieces of paper. Yeah. And so Nasea is going to draw an animal, and then we are going to see who draws that animal the best. Okay, Nasea is going to draw one. You can't look. Just put your hand in and draw. And then it's <laughs> monkey. Turn it on. So that's what we have to draw. On your mark, get set, go. That's what, that's what my. This what? is my He's got some bananas falling out of the tree on his head. He's a pretty happy monkey. Oh, he's got some hands, some feet, got his tail <laughs> curling up behind him. Uh, I think that's pretty cool. Uh, okay, to say your turn. This is my... Hold it up nice and... This is my so, banana angel. So let's move it this way so everybody can see. There is an Looks like a banana. It looks like a banana. Um, banana storm. It's with, banana a, storm. with a banana moon on it. That's sorry. <laughs> Got a halo. That's cool. That's a cool monkey. Okay, so all you viewers out there, you got to rate. You got you got to rate us, and uh, you pick the winner. All right. So who won this challenge? Maybe me. Of sketch wars. Is it the Sayas? Or is it Daddy's? Okay, so we're off to round two, Nasea. So we're playing three rounds. And uh, so this round is, let me see. Yep, this round is ready to start. Okay, you wanna pull out a piece of paper and we'll see what's on the pick one. We're going to be doing a lizard. Lizard. My friend Lucas's favorite animal. On your mark, get set. And go. <laughs> so you want to lift it up? There this lizard's go. name is Luke. This is Luke the lizard. This is oh, that's a nice little touch there, Nasea. You've got uh, got a little tongue out there, snapping a fly out of the midair. That's pretty cool. I like it. I love the legs and the claws. Beautiful tail, nice design. 
Nice eyes. Great job. Here's Daddy's. Daddy's. <laughs> I don't think I made the cut. No, I failed big time in this one. Anyway, I think Nasei is the winner for sure. All right. This is round three of Sketch Wars. Nasea, you want to go ahead and pull a piece of paper out of the hat. We'll see what animal is on that piece of paper. Here we go. Drum roll. There it is. Snake. Probably, probably backwards to you guys. On your mark, get set, go. <laughs> There's Bunny. Okay, I'm gonna hold mine up. Well, there's my snake. You see, little fork tongue there. Mmm, that's pretty much what all I got in the bag. Say, what do you got? I, <clears throat> I have a special guest, Kobe the Cobra. Kobe the Cobra? Whoa! Look at that. Look at the detail on the face, on that snake's face. Look at those fangs, look and, at that tooth. And also, wow. also don't forget about the feet bar of how long the cheeks can grow. Oh, 15 feet? 15, 15 feet? 15 feet apart. So who do you think won this challenge? I'm gonna... I, I've meant these, the cheeks can actually grow yeah. about 15 feet apart maybe. I think Nasea won this challenge again. It's just more descriptive. You got way more details, you got patterns. You even went so far as to add a little measurement in there. Well, we hope you enjoyed this episode of Sketch Wars. Yeah. Bye bye. See, See you ya. later. All right. We're going to play a game that we love playing together. It's called what? Let's say it. Connect Four. Connect Four. Here we go. <laughs> I won. Woo! Over here. Play again. Go. Okay. One right here. Crap. <laughs> Two wins for me. On your mark, it's set, go. Daddy opens again. Dad strikes crap. again. Crap, crap, crap. Crap, crap. Crap, crap. Round four. Every time we do four rounds, we change color. Okay, right? So what are we doing to say it right now? We're gonna look at all of these slides through this wooden box, through this beautiful microscope I had for my birthday. So we're going to look at almost of these slides. We're going to stand at least one, two, three, four of them for tomorrow. And we're gonna look at the rest. So let's see if we can look at some stuff. Mmm. Tell everybody what these slides are. What are on these slides? These, so these are definitely parts of plants and animals. And okay. we're going to look at lots of these slides. So, for example, I'm going to face something through the camera. You think we could show the viewers what's under the microscope? Yes. So, put the camera inside this piece right here so you can see. And then get into really good focus and then you'll guess what it is. See that? Ooh. That's a house bee mouth part. Those are house bee mouse parts. They're actually part of a real house bee. And they also have these and these things under it. They have these things under it. And I don't know what it is, but just 
Just guess what these tiny things are at the bottom. The second side. Our second side is Coprimus Mushroom Set. And put the camera through it, and you'll see what the mushroom part is. You see those lines? That's definitely the part of the of the porpoise mushroom. Okay, let's head over to the third slide. The third slide. The third slide is the sunflower stem. It's the sunflower stem. You want to see the edges? Sure you can. What is it called again? The sunflower stem. It's part of a sunflower and it's definitely, okay, it's not actually the real stem. Let's zoom in and let Here. everybody see it. Here, let me help you. Ooh, look at that. And Dad, keep it still. Keep it still with me. And then it's really hard to get it. Okay, let's head over. Let's hold. Let's head over to the to the fourth side. Welcome to the fourth side. Today we'll be looking at at the rabbit testes. Rabbit testicles. <laughs> yes. Oh that's, my goodness. That's what it is. I'm really interested to see what this is all about. Hold the phone and put it into. And look at that. That's what rabbit testicles look like? Yes, that's what it looks like! It looks like round donuts, wouldn't you say, guys? Oh my gosh, I would definitely love that. I would. I would definitely. Well, there it is. One more slide. This is the fifth and final slide of this channel. The dog esophagus parts. Dog esophagus parts. Yes, that's what it looks like. Let me see, like. stay there. Ooh, yeah, dog esophagus. Lead us into the unknown. And that can I help All right. you? What do you think that looks like? I'll give you a hint. It's somewhere in Australia. And it's where kangaroos actually hang oh, out. It looks like a steak. Mm. And it also looks like Australia's canyons. What else would you like to say about <clears throat> your microscope and all your slides. Do you like this kind of stuff? Yeah. Do you like doing this with Dad? Yes, but mostly I like to do this with Mom. Oh, okay. So I gotta step up my game. And I hope you'll enjoy this. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Again, like I said, it's just gonna be recreational. A bit of fun, a little inside look, as to uh, how I like to connect with my kids. Hey, if you enjoyed this video, why not uh, give this uh, a like, a sub, and ring that bell so you're reminded when I go live or I drop a new video for you to enjoy. Anyways, until next time, guys, thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you next time on FC Trent Tuner Note. See ya.